So now, back in the game. Um, so far what we have is that um, we successfully connected to our JDBC database. Uh, we are able to um, collect information from the schema and see what tables uh, we want to get. Uh, we move the uh, parameters from source code to the uh, JDBC connector entity. The next task is uh, to create types for the tables inside the database so we are able to uh, get actual entities or objects uh, from the database. So the next thing is uh, I have created the type that I will use to store um, the, the, the types <laughs> um, connected to the, to the actual tables. And that information is also saved into the JDBC connector instance. So what I do now is that I have the JC, JDBC connector instance. Uh, I see that I have a table type link definition, which is now set to the JDBC table type that I've created. So that's called a table type, but I don't like it because um, I used to use capitals for link definitions. So it's updated. Yes, it's updated. And now I would like to do the same thing as I have done with uh, the attribute definitions that I want to create um, link definitions. I'm looking for type link that's and for the first time I want to have entities there that value you uh, identified of course, of course that's ref, it's link that, never mind, um, the identifier is okay, uh, I don't like this longer version, so I just replace it with the shorter one, and these are just naming problems here. Okay, and first I just put reference definition entity so I can use to access the actual references from the type. So if I come here, I should have the link definition visible in the map refs, which is the, the table type link definition. That's fine. Then uh, I would be happy to get the target type from here. That's target type where I myself but I 
the key is now okay that's the yeah we'll get it directly so that's uh to the target type is what I get from the map with the key Target type. That's my graphs, gra of course. Interesting enough. Of course, now I have to think a bit about that. Uh, I guess it would be rather just ref. Actually, I want to use the ref. So yeah, the reference definition, oh, make it cleaner, the reference ID is the reference definition entities but I put that in reference No, 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 no. I need the entity itself that will be the ring definition. But I could access from self actual reference and I can put the referred 
Keep the actual reference. Mm -hmm. And then the target type would be Let's get um, type get This is a type, most likely, that I want to use to create a new instance for each table that I visit. So at this point, I would say that And that's the question, how I use this, what's the problem? I would be interested in the JDBC. In persistence, perhaps, because native ID. Store ID, dust utils, register service. Okay, then. Mm, there was there. Data command. Get entity. That is it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, that's that's the part. The get entity. Just getting closer. Last transition. session. Invoking entity. Entity. 
invoke entity, that's it. Okay, so invoke entity, the SA has the type, the S key Sets the primary type, sets the owner type owner ID. Mm -hmm. Very good. Type owner and ID. And it would be the global identifier. Okay, so the get entity, the first parameter is the target type. The second parameter is self. Context ref self, and I have to uh, create a unique ID which will be database name. I'm looking for that and DB name underscore and the table name. serious about this story, then I should also say that I have, I don't only have the table type link definition, but also a store unit where I want to store <coughs> the content of uh, this import and as I am quite serious about that I want to say that yeah I already have the store unit so I want to create a new unit sorry the store unit yeah 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 unit. I get the unit type because the primary type of the units will be link def item primary type store unit is of unit and I also create a unit which will be circular database. And I want to store Sakila database so the 
that's an interesting question if I can do that in my <coughs> current system. But you never know. Probably I can do that. But what I also want to do in this way is that I have the target type not from target unit should be Sakiva data ah. store unit and I want to say that utils access entity data command set value Um, generic ads identifier ID and I also want to say that Ref table type does uh, data links no Where is it then? I want to say that the resistant containing unit is persistent. And where are you in the unit? Okay, so it's um, the com links persistent containing units, and it is uh, Is the store unit that's where I want to keep it oh I have done many things at this point so let me check a few things for now as long as I am in the same method Um, there's no problem with uh, keeping the same running application instance. So let's see, the ref ID is table type. The actual ref is this thing. And I just put it there. And I also get reference to the Sakida database unit. 
So when I come out and say that I'm no, it doesn't work nicely because oh that's strange see it again map refs Okay, so in my map, map refs, I have table type and store unit. <laughs> Funny. Continue. You can just die here and see how it goes again. very interesting so let's go on I see that I have an ID succular actor get entity what's going on here It's weird how long it takes. I'm afraid I have some problems with the with, with some listening mechanism. So let's see how fast it's going. Theoretically, it's just done it. So if I'm looking for Sakila, I have nice JDBC table and it is for all the tables. If I check the Sakila actor, this is Persistent Okay, and tags and it changed and it is st stored in the secular database. Commit. I was able to commit it. Now I just close here and I say that I start it again. But now I want to check here we are in the output persistence. I have or should have of course after a refresh. Um, JDBC test. It somehow failed to save this part. 
which is not very nice. Okay, do it again. Let's store here on it. Okay, I'm afraid um, this doesn't work in this way because uh, referring to a unit is a complicated issue and I think I wasn't able to do it right. So I just want to say now that uh, the table type, so we name it, that I will I would rather create an attribute instead with the name of store unit name. That's what I said to this will be a circular database and that would be Is gonna draw. I would say that the DB name will be Sakila and I remove from here and I say commit because A problem here. I'm afraid I have destroyed um, with that experiment. So I should go back somewhere here. Here. 
guess I was unable to save it since then so I have to restore Just close everything and see if I can fix my error. Stored one file. That may may be wrong. Com. Yeah, it's today, but before. All right then. Theoretically, I have really restored it. JDB. C type Uh oh I don't exactly know what happens here. really weird
So yes, this is the JVC connector entity. And the minus 22. Minus 22. is in data and seven Simply like it is not set properly. Okay, I just 